Hello lovelies, this is Megan from Little Hot Tamale and today we're making spiral flowers out of paper. <laughs> okay, the first thing you will need to do is make a circle and it can be any size you want. I prefer making my circles between six inches and an inch and a half and that gives you a great variety of sizes for your flowers. Once you get your circles cut out, we are going to make a spiral. Now you can draw these on or you can just freehand it. And the width of your spiral determines how tall your flower will be. So this is a perfect opportunity to try different widths with different circles to see which size you prefer. Usually the larger the circle, the larger the width. Now it's time to start rolling our spiral. So you're going to start on the outermost point and roll inward toward the inner section of the spiral. I'm currently using cardstock, so the color is the same on both sides. If you want to use pattern paper with one side being a white, all you have to do is start with the pattern paper facing upright. That means towards you and then you're just going to roll over the pattern side so the rolled piece will end up being white facing you. After you're done rolling your spiral you will have a circle remaining and that is going to be the base of your flower. Now I'm just adjusting my flower and I'm just kind of opening the bud just a little bit by tapping it and kind of spreading it out just a little bit to get the shape that I prefer. Okay, and I'm just taking a dollop of hot glue and I'm just placing it on the circle base and I'm just laying the bud of the flower on top of it. Now I'm just going to repeat all the steps again for the smaller flower. Okay, so now you know how to make spiral flowers, so get creative. Try different size, circles, widths, or different types of paper. So, thank you so much for watching this episode of Build Your Stash, and I hope you have an amazing day. Toodles!